No. Guess no. who's defensive? Okay. So it's going crazy Star. over. Slow dance. Hey, everybody. Kyrie 091 hanging out with you. Boy, oh boy, are we going to have big fun today playing some more old school RuneScape. So we got something big planned for today. See, if you've been watching my channel, you know I have played RuneScape a lot, especially the free-to-play version. Uh, I know, I would like to think I know a great deal about it. However, there are actually two quests that have been released for old school RuneScape free to play in the last couple of years. Uh, one is the Corsair Curse, and the other one is Mistalin Mystery. I know nothing about either of these two quests, so um, I'm actually going to start Mistalin Mystery right now, and I'm going to do it along with you guys. Never having done this, having no idea how to do it, all I know is what the game tells me. Uh, and so far, it looks like I can start the quest by talking to Abigail or Huey. And there, uh, I guess here's Abigail and here's Huey sitting down, so let's talk to Huey. Help, help, says Abigail. What's happened here? We were invited to a house party on an island not far. Something went wrong. The whole thing went... The house seemed pretty creepy, but everything was going fine. We were having a good time. That's when we got attacked. I tried to save her. Huey brought me here to find an old boat. I went back to get him, but it was too late. I'm scared that he won't make it. You have to do something. They can't get away with this. What do you want me to do? The psycho is still out there. You have to bring them to justice. The boat we escaped on is over there. You can use it to get to the island. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Okay, so there's a boat around here that we have to use to get to an island. There's a boat. I'm guessing that's the boat we're looking for. So let's go get on board this rowboat over here, and we're going to take it over to take a look at this mystery. Okay, so here we are. I guess we're on an island. I have no idea what to expect here, guys. It looks kind of like Draenor Manor, doesn't it? I bet these are live trees like the ones at Draenor. All right. All right, I found the island where Abigail... I need to stop the killer. I'll have to find a way into the manor. The door is securely locked. I'll have to find the key. Okay. So if I learned anything from Ernest the Chicken, it's that these fountains have stuff in them. I see a fountain over here. Let's go take a look. I'm keeping my eyes open for stuff. Oh, there's a bucket. There has to be a bucket here for a reason. I'm going to take that bucket. Can I fill it with water? Okay, I can. I filled the bucket with water. There's a person over here. Oh, we're getting a little scene here when I walked over near the guy. Woo, party on, bro, says Sid. Uh-oh, Grim Reaper. What's he doing behind Sid? Totally felt some... Oh! Oh! <laughs> this, is, this is weird. Oh, I see the light. Oh, it's not my time. Oh, oh. The killer. It's not the Grim Reaper. It's a it's a murderer. It's like it's like Scream. This is so neat. I am already loving this quest. <laughs> he stabbed him. I thought he like touched him or something. Look at he has a bloody knife. Sid collapses as he falls down. Sees something shiny fall out of his pocket into the barrel of water. It was so horrible and drawn out. Wow, he's still going. Okay, I think he's dead now. I think he's actually dead this time. Who are you? Why are you doing this? The killer isn't saying a word, but he's walking away. He's a ghost face killer, like from Scream. How interesting. I gotta find a way to get into the house and stop that maniac. I wonder what it was I saw fall in the barrel. I'm guessing it was the key to the door, right? Let's uh, search the barrel of rainwater. The barrel is rain full of rainwater. I can't see what's in there. Okay, let's empty the bucket of water, and let's use the bucket on the bucket of rainwater. You fill the bucket from the barrel. Now let's search the barrel. We found a key. Let's examine this key. This should open the main doors of the manor. Use the Mythos Mystery Quest. So let's go over to the main door now. All right, so we didn't need the water from the fountain, but we needed it from the bucket of rainwater. Let, let's open the large door here. And we are inside of the creepy manor. Okay, so... Let's open this door. Let's talk to... This is so interesting. Okay. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no. He's gonna kill her too. Look. Oh, he got her. No. Oh. 
Everywhere I go, people get murdered. I need to leave this place before I get everyone killed. Okay, so he can go through the little wardrobe. A note. I guess I should read it. Okay, I want to. I want to get in that room and enter that wardrobe. He, he draw. He. The door is securely locked. A note. How do I read the note? It said he. It said something about. Oh, there's the note. Take note. You take a copy of the note. Let's read the note. Isn't murder just a work of art? Beautiful, yet haunting like the blade of a knife as we wander through the valley of death. And that's all he's got to say. Well, that's not that interesting. Uh, let's open this door. Someone going to die if I go through here? The door is securely locked. I guess I'm not opening that door. What about this door? Hey, one that's not locked. How about that? Uh, anything interesting in here? Fireplace? Nothing really to see there. Let's open this door and go into what looks like the kitchen. Oh, it's locked. Never mind. Boy, everything's locked around here. What an interesting quest this is, huh? Grandfather clock. Oh, there's something on there. I took a knife off the table, so I have a knife. What can I do with this knife? Stairs don't look so safe. I don't care. I want to go up them anyways. Uh, what can I do with this knife? Can I use the knife on, like, the door, maybe? To, like, nothing interesting happens. Okay, so obviously the knife, I can't use it to, like, break into one of these doors. Let's try to open, go in this room. Dining room, I guess. No, it's locked. Why do I have a knife? Examine fireplace. It's just a grand old fireplace. Is this room still locked where that girl was that she got murdered? It's securely locked. Even if I use a knife on it? Nothing interesting. What if I use a knife on this guy? Nothing interesting happens, of course. So, I just started this quest, and I'm already at quite the dead end here, because I have no idea what to do. Examine table. There's a painting on the wall. Let's examine the painting. Tree in autumn. I'm going to cut the painting. I'm going to cut this painting with a knife. Maybe there's something hidden inside of it. You sl Oh! You slash open the painting, revealing a hidden storage compartment. Let's search. Found a key. This is awesome. Oh, there's a door here I haven't even tried to open yet. The handles. The handles are color coded. The key I have is pink. And there's a pink doorknob over there. And if you look, that's a purple doorknob. That's like another kind of purple. And that's a green one. So this, this, and that's a pink one too. So this, I'm going to cut this other painting open. Use knife on other painting. Nothing interesting happens. Okay, so I guess I already got what I was going to get from the... Unless there's more paintings. Yeah, there's more paintings in here. Let's cut them all open. I'm going to turn the music down just a bit. Nothing interesting happens. Did I already get... All I was going to get out of these paintings? I think I might have. Now, the question is, what color key do I have? Portrait. Nothing happens. Let's use the knife on this last painting and see if we get anything. Okay, I guess that was all it was going to do for me. Okay, I think I have a key that maybe will get me into this room where that girl was killed. So let's check that out. Door is securely locked. What if I use the key on it? Use ruby key. Uh, can I examine the door? Red topaz. So I need a red topaz key. Let's examine this door. Ruby. So I can use the ruby key and the ruby door. The, with the ruby handle. But, and I lose the key. But hopefully the door is open for good now for the rest of my time on this quest. I don't have to unlock it again, I hope. There's a barrel. Danger explosive. So we have an explosive barrel. Um, there's a tinderbox in the shelf. Looks like a plain old tinderbox, right? I'll examine these shelves. Nothing. Should I blow up the wall? I'm going to search the crates before I do that, but I have a feeling if I use this tinderbox on that barrel, things are going to blow up nicely. I'm going to open this door. It's not locked, so I can just go in here as much as I please. I'm going to blow that door up, by the w that wall up, by the way. I just don't know exactly what that's going to do. Open the wardrobe. Search wardrobe. The wardrobe is empty. Open this wardrobe. That door has like some kind of lock on it too, by the way, it looks like. 
jade doorknob. So I can't open that one. The wardrobe is empty. Uh, okay, I guess it's time to blow that door up. Or the wall. Let's use the tinderbox on the barrel. The fuse is too damp to light. How can I dry this fuse? The fuse is too damp to light. Oh, there's sacks of something over here. I wonder if there's something in here that'll help me dry that fuse. Nothing interesting. What about these ones? Nothing. Okay, what about these boxes? Nothing. Nothing. There are tinder boxes on these shelves. Examine unlit candle. Examine unlit. Oh, you know what? Let's light the candles. You light the candle. Let's light this candle now, too. We'll have a bunch of lit candles. You light the candles. So we lit those ones. Are you lit? Unlit. So let's light all the candles in the room with the tinder boxes. How about that? I can't blow up the barrel, but I can at least light these candles. You light the candle. There's one more to light, and it's right there. Unlit candle. The room is sufficiently warm. The fuse should now have dried out. Now we can light this barrel. Let's do it. You attempt to light the fuse. I should get out of here before it blows. Uh, yeah, let's go in this room. Okay, so I went in this room, and we're getting a little cutscene. It looks like the wall's been blown open in that room. Something happened in there. Let's check it out. Climb damaged wall, so I can climb over this wall. Awesome. I'm back. Well, is this awesome? Yeah, I'm outside now. I don't know what to do out here, but here I am. That guy's dumb following me around like a wiener. All right, let's go in here. Oh, cool. Okay, so now I'm in this room on the other side of the jade door. I'm going to play the piano, you guys. There's no time to be playing around. What? I want to play the freaking piano, though. Alright, so these candles are already lit, so that's clearly not what I'm doing in this room. Um, a grandfather clock. Let's check that out. There's a... Looks a bit shabby. Alright, there's a picture on the wall. Examine spooky picture. Its eyes look everywhere except at you. Let's use the knife in the spooky picture. Nothing interesting happens. Okay, so apparently that wasn't it. What about this door? Can I open it? Yeah, I need a key. I knew that was going to happen. Um, I have no idea where to go now. Okay. Maybe I'm not in the right area. Maybe I need to go see that. There's a guy over there. Let's go check him out. I can see a yellow guy back here. Let's go see what he's got to say. Oh, well, I guess this person's going to die too because everyone I walk near dies. Please stop this. Just let me go. We're going to play a game. Do you like games? No, yes. Whatever you say, just don't hurt me. Whether or not you get hurt is up to you. Your fate is in your own hands. What? What do you mean? Leave her alone, you monster. Ah, Kyrie091. How kind of you to join. Now, if you say another word, I will end her right now. Sorry, where were we? Ah, yes, of course, the game. Do you like quests, Lacey? Yeah, sure, I like quests. Do you like scary quests? Uh-huh. What's your favorite scary quest? I don't know. You have to have a favorite. The one with the vampire who lives in the big house. Oh, Vampire Slayer. We just did that one. Good, good. And now for that game I spoke about. I'm going to ask you but one question. Get it wrong and you die. Get it right and you will live. Oh, Guthix, please no. I don't want to die. Think hard about your answer. You like vampires, so this should be easy for you. Who is the vampire that resides in South Misthalen? Um... I'm not supposed to say anything, because the guy said if I speak, he will kill her. So I'm going to say nothing, even though Count Draenor, I think I think that's right. Lacey, Lacey, I did tell you to think hard about your answer. Count Draenor is a vampire. He does reside in a manor in Mistalin, but that manor is in West Mistalin. I was talking about Count Check. Thanks for playing. You tricked me. This isn't fair. Ask me another. Oh, he's going to kill her. This creep keeps killing everyone. This is a pretty troubling quest. Oh, he's, he dropped another note on the ground. Let me have that note. This quest is very disturbing. 
Oh my goodness. I have to stop him. Let's see what this note says. Let's take a note. Let's take a copy of the note. Let's read it. It's like music to my ears. The glorious sound spelling out your fate. Oh, I get it. He's telling me to play the piano. You remember earlier this note said something about is murder a work of art? Haunting like the blade of a knife. Right, he was telling me to cut open the painting to get the key. Now he's telling me to play the piano. But what do I have to play? Hang on, let me read the note. There's got to be a clue in the note. It's glorious sounds spelling out your fate. So he, he, my fate, what is my fate? Dead? Is my fate D-E-A-D, -E dead? D, E, A, D. Ho oh, ho! Yes, I got it. Oh my god, I can't believe I'm guessing at this, and I can't, and I got it. You find a key hidden inside the piano's compartment. We got a key, you guys. It's the emerald key. We need to find an emerald door to use it on, though. What what kind of door are you? Opal. We already know that one's jade. Uh, where is the emerald door? Emerald. Okay, so we have to get back outside. That's so funny that I guessed that he was he wanted me to spell out the word dead with the piano and I got it right. That was this is fun. I am I am digging. I am digging this quest. Okay. So the door this door better still be unlocked, the ruby door, because I use the ruby key. Yes it is, good. Alright, so that door is open for me. I can unlock the emerald door now because I have an emerald key. And we are in this room. Alright. Uh, search old bookshelf. Let's take a look at that. None of them look very interesting. What is this? Hat stand? Can I open this door? Is this door... Oh, gosh. Getting a cutscene. Okay, he's gonna kill someone. Why am I the always one left alone cleaning up after everyone? Oh, Mandy, you're gonna die. Hello, anyone there? There's some noise going on in there. Lacey, Sid... No, they're both dead, man. I guess I should check it out. No point in staying in this nice locked room when I can go outside into the creepy darkness. Seriously? The walls seem too thick and for Mandy to be able to hear you, but I can hear her just fine. That's weird. I don't think there's any need to take this big shiny weapon to defend myself. Nothing ever, nothing bad ever happens when people go out to check on noises in the darkness. You've got to be kidding. Okay, here I go. All right, so she's going outside, and she's leaving that big sword behind. Hello, anyone out here? I can't really see her that well. See, I knew nothing would happen. Must have been a squirrel. Oh. Well, I guess she's alright. Good for her. Back to the dishes. That was lucky. No! The killer's in the room! Turn around, Mandy! Save yourself! Oh, he got her. No, why me? The psycho, he was toying with her. Give me another note. Thank you. I think you just put a note on the ground. This guy likes play another note. This guy likes playing games. This is going to be a game he won't win. I wish he would just fight me one on one like a man instead of playing this game with me, but whatever. Let's read his note. Here at first these words. Each murder you witness helplessly from start to end as you fail to solve the final letters of the quiz. Razor sharp like a gemstone is the blade of my knife. The last sound you hear will be your scream's echo. Held heed that I will have the final word in this thriller. Hear these words. Okay, look at the note. It, he wrote out a word. He wrote the word hearth. H-E-A-R-T-H. The first letter of each line. Hearth. So, what is a hearth? I think it's... Can I open this door? It's locked. What kind of door is it? Diamond. Okay. So I need to find a hearth, whatever that is. I think that's like a fireplace. Uh, I don't know. Is it? Can I open this door? No. What kind of door are you? You're an opal door. Yeah. I can't open this one either. That's something else. Dragonstone. Yeah. So I can't open any of the doors. But what is what is a hearth though? I thought a hearth was like a fireplace or something. I, I don't know what a hearth is, unless I'm misunderstanding. Hear it first, these words. Each murder, 
Here each right now. As you fail to solve the final letters of the quiz, S, the final letters of this quiz. I'm trying to figure out if it could mean something other than hearth. It's got to be hearth, but I don't know what that would mean. Um, all I'm finding is these fireplaces, so I must be doing something wrong. I'm going to go back in this room I was just in and take a look in there. It's not the hat stand I'm looking for. Let's look at the portrait. Let's cut the portrait. Can I cut this portrait? Nothing interesting happens. Of course not. What did the first note say? Let's search this bookshelf. Did I already search the bookshelf? Search the books? None of them look very interesting. Examine old bookshelf. Filled to the brim with knowledge. I can't do anything with the rug on the ground. Other than that, there's candles here. Can I get in this room? No, I can't get in that room. Can't do anything with the candles. I'm lost. What kind of door is that? Red red topaz. I need, I'd like to find another key somewhere around here. Looks a bit shabby. I must I must be missing something. Can I go upstairs yet? They don't look so safe. I must be missing something on this note. Here at first, these words. Each murder you witness helplessly from start to end. As you fail to solve the final letters of this quiz... Razor sharp like a gemstone is the blade of my knife. The last sound you hear will be your scream's echo. Heed that I will have the final word in this thriller. Man, I am lost. I'll admit it, guys. I don't know what to do at this point. Maybe I should go back outside. I'm going to climb over this wall and head back outside, I guess, and see if there's something over on this side of the building. Because there certainly isn't anything in where I'm looking right now. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Okay. I'll examine this fireplace. The grand old fireplace. Okay, I'm starting to think that the fireplace has nothing to do with it. Grandfather clock has nothing to do with it. I've been outside and there's nothing outside. I'm getting tired of this song, so I'm going to turn the music off because it's playing the same song over and over again. Okay, so I can't walk through there, so I know that's not it. Oh my goodness. Can I um, um, search the piano? We'll play the piano. Ha! Cool. Alright. Uh, that's a jade door that I can't open, but I've been in that room anyway. That's the dining room, I think. Wow, dude, what do I do? I'm lost. I'm completely and totally lost. I got a feeling like I need to be back in that, that room I was in where I got the note from him because everything else I've done so far I haven't had to backtrack really everything else I've done I've been able to kind of move forward and I think that's the point of the quest is to keep progressing through each room so I don't think I'm gonna need to go back at all you know what I mean wow dude there's nothing in this room. It can't be this room. And I can't open this door because that door has a diamond lock on it. Holy biscuits, man. Hey, everybody. Kyrie091 here. This episode ended up running really super long. This Mistal and Mystery Quest proved to be a lot longer than I expected it to be. So what I did was I chopped it up into two episodes after I recorded it. So if you want to see the exciting conclusion, exciting conclusion to Mistal and Mystery, you're going to have to stick around the Kyrie channel and check out next time for more Let's Play Old School RuneScape. Bye, everyone.
Hey everybody, Kyrie091 here. If you enjoyed this video and you want more content from me, or maybe you just like the sound of my voice like I do, consider subscribing to the Kyrie091 channel for more big fun.